Hi, I'm Jennifer from Texas, and I am a lifelong Republican voter. In fact, I cast my first vote for president for George H.W. Bush, and I have voted Republican in every presidential election since then, until 2016. I did not vote for Donald Trump in 2016, and I will not vote for Donald Trump in 2020, and this is why. Even back in 2016, I worried about what Donald Trump might do to the Republican Party, and more importantly, to our country. And frankly, a lot of the things I feared and imagined have turned out even worse than I expected. In my opinion, President Donald Trump is a very real threat to our democracy. He's a destructive leader who only knows how to sow hatred and division, and I'm tired of it. There's no amount of Republican judicial appointments or tax cuts that can offset or justify what Trump has done to destroy the rule of law in our country. He doesn't represent any conservative principles, and he's a threat to our security and our standing in the world. He has debased the office of the presidency, and it's time for Trump to go. That's why in November, I will cast my vote for Joe Biden for president, and I'm hoping more Republicans join me. I'd ask my fellow Republican friends and voters across this country to dig deep and consider what's at stake. You're not alone if you've had enough of our country and our party torn apart these past four years. I'm tired of it. If there's ever been an election where we all should take a breath focus on what matters, and put country over party. This is it.